Carisha doing the same motherfucking thing, chat. She auditioning for Rick Ross. Hold on, chat. Experience luxury in every drive with the 2024. I don't call the bitch. I, sometimes I call the young man, might be slipping up, but I call the bitch Carisha because I got introduced to her as Carisha because before I knew exactly who the fuck the city girls was <clears throat> i seen a documentary and so on the documentary she was introduced as carisha and everybody would call her carisha and then after she got in the industry they manufactured a name for the bitch young miami but she was initially going by carisha when she signed to qc and the label gave her that name now i'm not saying that. look at them titties look at them titties they just sit I told y'all, chat. I'm I'm the original freaky ass nigga. Look at it. She must have got them titties done or something. Now wait, hold on, chat. Hold on, chat. I got to be a pervert now, Uncle old freaky ass nigga now. Uncle old freaky ass nigga now. She is gorgeous. Hold on, chat. It's fat nigga off screen. Look, chat. Look, look, look. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Look what she doing for him. Look what she doing for him. Look what she doing for him. Yeah, yeah. She tried to. She tried to come up on her boss. Look at her. Look at her. They was flirting the whole interview, and they both from Miami. You know Rick Ross on his yeah. You know. You you, you dealing with the biggest boss. You know, it's, it's nothing, you know. You know, I spend a little money on a bitch. Yeah, he see, he don't like the fact that she fucking with that new, even though he might be cool with Diddy. You know, Diddy from New York. He from Miami. He feel like she need to be with a real Miami nigga. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, chat. They were flirting their ass off in this motherfucker, chat. We got to organize what's happening. So what's the most you spending? Um... Like I said, I done spent some change. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Because when I talk about spending change, we talking automobiles all the way down. And it depends on, you know, shorty, if I can, you know, if I like you, shorty, you got to impress the boss. How do you impress the boss? Oh, man. How do you impress the boss? You got to make me smile. Mm -hmm. And there's different ways you could do that. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You could do that a lot of different ways. You know what I mean? You might know how to give me a massage. You might sit up late night while I'm watching forensic files and laugh with me when the people get stalked down. I don't know. Chat. Now, in case y'all don't know, the City Girls is all about fuck a nigga for a bag. Don't fuck with no broke niggas. We don't fuck with broke niggas. Get a nigga with a bag fucking on a rich nigga, fucking on a scamming ass rich ass nigga. That's what the city girls is about. And so, what Carisha gonna ask the nigga? So how much you spending on the bitch? Cause I think she asked him twice, like what's the most amount of money? And like how much you spending? She trying to get to the nitty gritty chat. She trying to see what what the boss trying what, what the boss willing to do for Big Mama for real. That's what she on. Ross, the pussy right here. What you willing to? It's right here. She might have well did this. This what she might have well did. Ross. This what she might as well have did, chat. You see what I'm, you see me, chat? Oh, you can't see me. She might as well have did this, chat. She might as well have did this shit. It's right here. This what she might as well have did, chat. It's right here. That what she might as well have did. So what do it take to impress the boss? What do I need to do to impress the boss? Huh? Tell me what I need to do to get that bag, Danny. What I need to do to get that bag, Danny. 
Tell me what a bitch got to do to get that bag, Diddy. That what she trying to figure out. Hold on, chat. Um, but if you make me smile, mm -hmm. that's priceless. Mm -hmm. It ain't no limit on that. What's that? What's your favorite type of massage? Mm, that deep tissue. Mm. I fly a lot, so I had them knots in my shoulder. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you feel me? But uh, that deep tissue, I need that. Cheese and hard in the bitch, chat. Listen, mm -hmm. it ain't no limit on that. What's that? What's your favorite type of ma look, chat? Look, massage. Mm, that deep tissue. Mm. I fly a lot, so I had them knots in my shoulder. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you feel me? Bitch laugh like that chick, then she gone. Chat, if the bitch grinning like that, she gone. My nigga, she gone. She gone. You thought she was yours? Nope. It's over, playboy. Take that, take that, take that. Nigga got a bitch grinning like that. Titty sitting. She gone. Yeah. But uh, that deep tissue, I need that. You got a big personality because you're Aquarius. And I'm an Aquarius. That's what that is? Yeah, we got big personalities. And it, it's hard to match our personality. And they both Aquariuses. You know bird bitches like that is into the zodiac signs and shit. Ooh, we're both in Aquarius, so we'll work because I know how Aquarius work. You got big personality like me, boo. I know how I handle you. Ooh, I'm going to knock my camera over tripping. So I really want to know, like, how can a bitch make, you know, product? Hold on, Chad. We got to mute the ad. I just want to show. I just want to show y'all a couple parts. So we ain't gonna. We ain't gonna watch this whole motherfucking thing. I just want to show y'all a couple parts where this bitch was showing her ass. That's the only way you separate yourself from everywhere. You know, everybody else who's doing it. Yeah. So the slippery so shit. What the plan is? Shit. You know what I'm saying <laughs> because that's that's how the game go. It's just like that. Hold on, Chad. I got to show y'all my favorite part. Because she asked him, what a turn you off about a bitch? Or something like that. And he said, and I quote, a bitch that talk too much. Listen. Fuck him or whatever it is. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe it could be the angles. I mean, I, I honestly don't know. But I feel like you and Drake made hits together. For real. You and Drake. Beautiful woman. This way he got aggravated. Hold on. I'm telling you, wait, chat, y'all got to follow me if you listen. I know if you watch it, it might be kind of slow, but follow me, listen. Because now this just put me in in, in the remembrance, because I watched this whole motherfucking thing. It put me in remembrance of the, the way shit went. Like, the flow of shit. It was like they was talking and it was cool, and she was woo de woo woo and they was, it was vibing. As you could see how the bitch was grinning. Then she started asking about Drake. And she asked about Drake like two or three times. And it was like, by the last time you could see in this nigga's face, he was aggravated as fuck. Like, bitch, you going to keep asking me about Drake? Bitch, I done already told you about Drake. Hold on, watch. Hold up. I swatch, but is it a phone call for you to just pick up the, the real thing? What we feel like we know is... He said something about French Montana and you defended French Montana like you. This the first time she asked. So like, what is the beef about? You know, said something to Drake when you wasn't mentioned, but you saying Drake said your name first. Yeah, like I, you know, like I said, uh, he mentioned my name and that's a no, no. Don't do that. Especially when it ain't about no real shit. But when you do that, OK, then this is how we going to play. That's cool. Mm -hmm. I enjoy that. I can wake up every day and say BBL Drizzy or some more shit while I'm smoking a joint, listening to the waterfalls and all that shit, mm -hmm. looking at the birds fly off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That shit, that shit easy for me. But so that was is real... everybody built for this? Mm -hmm. Is everybody built for this? So it's a real thing. 
Um, it, it most definitely could be a real thing. Mm -hmm. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? How do you feel about route beef? Um, I've been a part of several things, but you got to realize for me, I feel like it's, um, you know, as an artist, I look at it like sometimes it's hustlers. You got to protect your real estate. You got to know what's yours. You got to understand. When I came into the game, I initiated certain things just so people would understand. I had no problem with that. You know what I'm saying? Right. And if you stepped on my toes or however it was, we could we could do this anyway. And I take, I take, I I I, I rarely take L's. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? And so I, I made that clear. And I think people got that picture. You know what I'm saying? So when it comes to certain things, you know. But other than that, I'm getting to the money. I'm getting to the business. I inspire youngsters. Mm -hmm. But don't don't fuck up. Yeah. So when it came to, because it was at one point Drake and Meek was beefing, and you came in and you come that situation. Can you swash the, well not swash, but is it a phone call for you to just. This is the second time the bitch asked about Drake right here, chat. <clears throat> he already answered the shit. Why it started is because of this, this, and this. He did this, but it ain't this, so I ain't tripping. Here go time number two. So when Meek Mill and Drake was beefing, you was able to come in and, you know, squash that or whatever. So with this situation here, do you think it could be just something like a phone call and y'all could squash it this time number two? Chat, follow me. This is an audition. Carisha's trying to find her a new sugar daddy. The beginning of the interview is roses and bubbles and getting to know and what you like and 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 what how much you spending and what a bitch gotta do and all this other shit. And I think in the beginning half is when he mentioned the shit about them both being from Miami. It's a Miami thing, whatever, whatever. <clears throat> now we at the Drake questions. It's the second time she asked chat. Follow me. Just pick up the phone and call Drake and y'all just. I don't know, it depends on how I feel. If I had Luke Belair already that morning, it may be a good day. <laughs> if I haven't, you never fucking know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> because that's that's how the game go. Mm -hmm. It's just like that. Mm -hmm. Fuck them or whatever it is, you know? But other than that, I ain't lose no sleep over none what of that shit. What inspired you to do BBL, Treasy? Do you really feel like you got a BBL? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Why you feel like that? World, the time has come to... Hold on, chat, my bad. Hold on. <clears throat> See, now she asking about the BBL Drizzy. Why you feel like that? Oh, she, she could have left it at. You feel like you got a BBL? You know what I mean? It is what it is. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. Right. He looked like he had a BBL to you. <laughs> I don't think he had a BBL. No. Look at that face. That's the second time we done caught the bitch in that look, chat. Hold on. I'm telling you, that hoe is going. I am a player. Okay? I am a player. One thing I can identify. Listen, I am the original gigolo. One thing I can identify is when a bitch is ready to go. Let's keep watching. It is what it is. He looked like he had a BBL to you. <laughs> I don't think he had a BBL. No. I don't. She is so cute to me. It's like as I'm watching this shit, I am developing a fucking infatuation, an, an infatuation for Carisha. I never really looked at her like this. Is it the makeup? I mean, when I watched the interview, I was looking at her like, you know what I mean? Cause, but I ain't never really been attracted to Carisha like that. I don't know what's happening here. I don't the bitch. But, oh, shit. God damn it. I just figured out what's happening. Shit. The bitch is using her goddamn sorcery. Oh, how did I miss that, chat? I'm sitting here telling y'all the bitch auditioning. I forgot. How did I forget that? 
The, that's why. That's it, because it happened to me the other night, chat. This bitch is using her goddamn female sorcery, chat. That what the fuck is going on? Because I'm sitting here, and I'm becoming mesmerized by this bitch. And I ain't never been into Carisha like that. I've always been Team JT. Yeah. That's right, the bitch sitting here using a goddamn sorcery on the nigga. Yeah. But anyway, continue back. Here we go with the Drake shit. I don't know. I done turned my headphones off, chat. Hold on. God damn, I done fucked up, chat. Hold on. Shit. Hold on, chat. God damn, chat. Hold on. Man, hold on, chat. I got to get my headphones back going, man. Yeah, man, this hoe is up here using her goddamn female trickery and sorcery. Got me mesmerized. I'm sitting up here looking like, God damn, bitch. All right, here we go. Here we go, chat. Back to uh the hoe and Drake. Talking too much. What about his nose? Did it look the same when y'all first met? I feel like if you certain pictures, certain angles, I feel oh. like angles are important. Oh, so angles. I don't know if it's an angle. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. <laughs> So I don't know, maybe it could be the angles. I mean, I, I honestly don't know, but I feel like you and Drake made hits together. For real, you and Drake had so- Right there, chat. <laughs> Look at his face, chatty man, the bitch. So you just gonna keep talking about this whole ass Canadian light-skinned pussy-ass nigga, huh? Bitch, you just gonna keep asking me about Drake, bitch. That's what he thinking. Look at his face. He had to take a sip of the shit. Look. Look. Don't listen to me. Look. Important. Oh, so angles. I don't know if it's an angle. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Together. For real, you and Drake had. Did you see his mother? He looked at this bitch like, yeah, bitch, you just gonna keep asking me about this nigga chat. Listen, look. Look at my bad chat. Look at his face. Look at him. Look at him. That is the face of, bitch, you just gonna keep asking me about Drake. You just gonna keep motherfucking asking me about this nigga, bitch. This nigga is fed up at this point. Everything was cool. But she just got to know about Drake. What the fuck is up with these hoes and these light-skinned ass niggas? They can't fight! Fuck you so amazed by this yellow-ass nigga fuck. I like Drake with the melodies. I don't like Drake when he act tough. You mesmerized by this old light-skinned, pretty-eyed ass nigga. Fuck that nigga, bitch. That nigga hand ain't never done no work a day in his life, ho. I done got triggered in this motherfucker. Fuck them goddamn light-skinned. Fuck them. Fuck them up against the wall. All them goddamn light-skinned niggas. Fuck them. Shamar Moore, motherfucking Michael Ely. Mother and Chris Brown, well, his last name Brown, and he's really a dark-skinned nigga on the inside, so we're going to give Chris Brown a pass. Uh, Mano get a pass. Fuck DJ Envy. Fuck DJ Khaled. Oh, uh, who else? All them light-skinned niggas. Yellow Beezy. Fuck all of them. Goddamn light-skinned niggas. Get on my goddamn nerve, pretty-ass nigga coming to goddamn party, take all the hoes. They pretty ass just walk in there looking pretty. I got the conversation on a bitch all goddamn night. This was in my younger years. 
I became a better player as I, you know, became more experienced and shit. Light skinned nigga better watch out, nigga. I don't give a damn how pretty you is, nigga. Anyway, look at this. Face of disgust on this nigga. You and Drake had so many hits together. Like, why can't we all just stay together as one, as a unit? Like, why did, why did it have to go that far? Bitch, it had to go that far because he's a whole ass nigga, bitch. And I can't tell you that on camera, bitch. He's a whole ass nigga, bitch. He fake. He run around. He stab niggas in the back. He act like he your friend. And when you're hot and shit. And then as soon as you cool off, he don't fuck with you. If you come in with a bitch, he make it his goddamn business to backdoor you and go fuck your hoe. That's why, bitch. That's why. That nigga ain't even from here. He is not like us. That nigga's a whole ass nigga, bitch, and we don't play the motherfucking games, bitch. He don't have no bro code, no loyalty, no nothing. He a fake ass nigga. Who is he? One minute he talking like the white boy, the next minute he ponder on do my ting. Who is this nigga? That's why, bitch. Ask me all these motherfucking questions, ho. Come on, they're finished watching this shit. Like why? You see him biting his motherfucking lip. I'm not making this shit up, Chad. I'm looking at what the fuck is in front of my face. I'm not making this up. That nigga's upset right now. Bitch. You ask me about this motherfucking vanilla... Wait for ass nigga again, bitch. And I'm just playing. I don't have nothing against light skinned people. Uh, entertainment. But anyway, look at this shit. Look at the disgust on this nigga's face. He's upset. He biting his fucking lip. The one as a unit. Like why did why did it have to go that far? Like why? Um. How that make you feel just to know that y'all was just making hits together so now y'all ain't even on good terms? You know... God damn it, bitch. You gonna ask me two motherfucking questions about this whole ass nigga back to back, bitch? I ain't even mad. Bitch, I ain't even get a chance to answer the first question, bitch, because I don't even know how to answer it. And you gonna ask me another question about this old vanilla cream ass nigga again, bitch? Another one? Oh, me, me being boss, I already understand. Everybody don't understand. And this is what I'm telling y'all about how this bitch talked too much. And some shit that she didn't say it is going to help sink Diddy. Watch what I'm talking about. And mm, a lot of this shit be a misunderstanding. But when women. Hold on, chat. It's a part I'm trying to get to. After that, I know I done took a minute, chat, but... <sighs> Hold on, chat. Bear with me. It's a part I'm trying to get to with this whole hill. Fashion first. Mm-hmm. It fly. Oh, that's too easy. We talking about... It's in the house. She's... On the light. Came at once. Uh-huh. Nah. And what's so funny, Chad, as soon as I, when I find it, he answered the question with that shit so motherfucking fast, Chad. Hold on. Or you just moving the way you want to move. Did she fuck you, put you to sleep, and make you a sandwich. Yeah. So she just made that up. Oh, with me, we would have stripped them nigga from the back looking at you. Well, I don't fuck strangers, so <laughs> get to know them. <laughs> Cause say like a little landy script. I'm gonna say foreplay. What type of Just what type of movie you like? Look, nah, and if you know, it's it's like if you listen to somebody, Hold you know. Chat. And I know she really loved Rose. Hey, you just a good businessman. <laughs> you think you got some hands? Fuck with Rose. Mm -hmm. Other than that, mm -hmm. yeah, I block out anything that's. 
mm-hmm. in the background though. We yeah. ain't even. Why not? Why they ask? No, of course. Because it, it, if y'all gonna stay up all night, you know what I mean. Let's see. You know what I mean. But you gotta imagine those no can't know it sheen <laughs> right off the top. I wish I'd have fucking wrote it down, Chad. Can I get a Carisha, please? Just stay. What inspired you to do BBL, Treasy? Do you really feel like you got a BBL? Are you ready for the smoke? I love it. I can't wait. You sure you ready for the smoke? I'm telling you. <laughs> Easy. Mm-hmm. What are we talking about? Are you still working out? I work out a little. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You might be de- dealing with somebody. Cheap. Because a lot of rich men be cheap. But I have, and I do. It's like if you listen to somebody, you know, and I know she really loves having fun. <laughs> she cool, but she lost. I'm going to change her life. Tia said she fuck you, put you to sleep, and make you a sound. Yeah. So she just made that up. Oh, <laughs> big. You saw a video of what? I saw, I don't what? know. Like I said. Rosé felt like a drink was, <laughs> so that was like work. You dig? You didn't get touched. We saw that. That's what it's about. Mm-hmm. And that's we got to the crib. Mm-hmm. What a parking lot for the chat. Ain't none. Me, them the niggas that was upset. They was close. What type of head you like? Do you like slop your? It may need to be another way. <laughs> what type of head you like? I'm telling you, she auditioning for this nigga chat. Hold on, I got to find this part. <clears throat> and I'm going back to the Diddy shit. Miss Smith still. I ain't know. I ain't. <laughs> Raw or safe sex? You got, you got, it's big business out here. You got business to handle. You can't just really be fucking with strangers. Bringing but, her back to the yeah. bitch talk too much. From Rose, you may want to get to know somebody. Biggest turn off. I don't know. Might be a bitch talk too much. Don't talk. Message. Message, bitch. You talk too much, bitch. Message. If you want to fuck with the boss, you got to shut the fuck up. Like that young girl he had to get rid of that couldn't fucking cook on the internet talking shit about all his past bitches. And not where her ass at, bitch. You talk too much. All you had to do was shut the fuck up, look pretty, suck and fuck the man, and goddamn it, spend his money. But you wants to run your motherfucking mouth, bitch. You got the clout. Motherfucker don't know. Man, listen. Here you go. This is the part I'm talking about right here, chat. It depends. Hey, bitch. Bitch talk too much. I don't know. Might be a bitch talk too much. Get to know somebody. And he was dead ass motherfucking serious when he said it too. I'm telling y'all, chat. I'm I read I look at facial expressions, I read body language. I told y'all when the Wayne video dropped, when he was talking about how disappointed, how hurt he was, I told y'all that Jay-Z had to been the one because of the way he said it, how many times he said it, the facial expression he made, I read. Through all of it. And then what it do, chat? A couple days later, it come out that the NFL say, hey, we ain't had nothing to do with that Kendrick Lamar shit. That was Jay-Z by himself. He don't want to pick him up. Right here, this nigga dead serious. She is auditioning for this nigga. What's your biggest turn off? I don't know. Might be a bitch talk too much. Bitch. Yeah. Biggest turn off. I don't know. Might be a bitch talk too much. Don't talk too much. <laughs> so you're like a quiet bitch. It depends. A bitch can't be asking me, Ooh, what flavor is this, Bel Air? <laughs> oh my God. Just chill, baby. Look at the bottle. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, dude. 